Hello there, I'm glad you make it through. I want to show you what is your assignment and how you can submit the work you will complete while working with me inside of the classes. In the resources, you will have a file where you have four sample animations which you can use to create the flat shadows. You can use, of course, your compositions, but if you don't have any animations ready, you can take this file and simply work on it. Okay, I've completed one animation here where the shadows flies around it was completed in one of the lessons, you will see this very soon. And what to do once you are ready with the assignment. I want you to submit a screenshot of the work you've done or an entire animation if you placed some keyframes and animated this whole thing. Once you are ready with the animation, hit Ctrl or Command, Shift and forward slash. This will add the animation to the render queue. Choose the output module so the video won't be too big. I am using for example the H.264 codec and in the format options I have 30 target bitrate and this creates a not too heavy mp4 file which I can use to showcase my work. I hit render and I wait for the ready file. Ok, the render is done. To showcase my work I want to create a GIF file and a thumbnail for my project. It would be perfect if you have Photoshop, the CS6 extended version at least where you can simply import, video frames to layers, select the file you have rendered, double click on it, just hit OK and the animation will automatically import into Photoshop. I can select now any image I want for my thumbnail. Let's say I select this, I just hit File, Save As, I save the file as a thumbnail and then when I want to create a GIF, I go to File, Save for Web, and I create a GIF file. I wait a moment until it loads. The GIF file is now pretty heavy, it's 2 megabytes. I make it smaller to the width of example 500 pixels. I can lower the color amount, I can lower the ditter to make the file size even smaller, but I think that's not necessary here. I save the file and I have a ready GIF I can upload to our assignment. I will be really really happy to see if you were put this information to action and create projects of your own. Thank you for your attention in this preparation lesson and now we can head over straight to the content and start designing our flat shadows. We will start out with the first technique using the CC Radial Fast Blur. See you there!